Okay, I wanted to go over my uh, my backup <clears throat> for stormy weather and such. <clears throat> what I've got is that 800 watt uh, two cycle generator out there. Uh, picked it up at the Harbor Freight store for 89 bucks on sale, and I bought the two year replacement warranty for 20 bucks. So. Basically, for 110 bucks, I got 800 watts guaranteed for two years. Um, <clears throat> wanted to give it a try. I could, I couldn't spend big money on a big generator, so I bought that one. Anyway, here's what we got. I, uh, I got the power running in here. I split the wires so that I could, uh, I could test the amps and see what we're drawing. And right now, I'm drawing 2.8 amps. That equates to uh, 300 and some odd watts. We'll just, uh, for easy math, say uh, 3 amps times 100 volts is uh, uh, 300 watts. So we're a little over 300 watts. So that's what we're pulling off the generator. It's good for up to um, 800 watts. And the thing will run about 8 hours on a gallon of gas for that uh, drawn... Uh, drawn on the, the 300 amps up to like half of the rating it'll run for eight hours on a gallon of gas so okay <clears throat> here's what I got I've got that battery charger wired in I would love to run it on 75 amp but I can't it'll uh, burn it up I've got it run oops, I've got it running on 12 amp here and it's charging. It'll turn green. This is automatic charger. It'll stop when the batteries are fully charged. I've got this charger set at 6 amps. And that one's set on 6 amps. This is just a 1 amp trickle charger and that one set at 12 volts that's a 6 or 12 volt selection so right there I've got according to the rating place I got 12 plus 6 it's 18 plus 1 there's 19 should have 20 watts right there or 20 amps and then I've got this guy um, this is old this is old rectifier 6 volt 12 volt and it has a uh, uh, rheostat type of switch on it as a, this one actually tells you the amps it's pumping in there it says it's pumping six amps at twelve and a half volts and then we turn it down we're down to like one amp two three four five six seven eight nine yeah it's about an amp per click Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Anyway, that's what I'm charging the batteries with. All right. Oh, there we go. Three point two amps. Getting a little bit more juice probably out of this guy right here. Must have had a. Now watch what happens as I turn that one down. One click, two clicks, three clicks four clicks, five, six, that's all the way down, that's all the way up, there we go, 3.3 amps AC, <clears throat> charging the batteries up, when I started that, I was, uh, was at like 12.4, and I'm at 12.6, uh, so, the uh, solar panels have quit draw, bringing any in any power, at least very little. 18 volts, putting point two amps into the system. All right, so uh, what I uh, what I did was I ran my refrigerator all last night, all day today. I also ran my lights. I ran my computer. My my uh, uh, tablet, charge that up. My phones, the heater. I ran all these things all day today, and uh, at points I was drawing more watts than I was putting in. 
I, I put it as much as 190 into the system today um, and that's just with the everything temporarily temporarily wired up running off these <coughs> got awful extension cords and only using one of the big 230 watt panels so I am going to uh, hook these in in a little bit more permanent situation and probably wire them right into the bus bars this one for sure that's a that's a hoss that'll that'll charge some batteries good all right so I just wanted to show my secondary backup and and uh, um, you know rather than buying a big five six hundred dollar generator um, I just bought the little bitty guy because I've got a generator right there as long as I keep them batteries charged up and that's my main goal all right let me know what you think about that setup sorry the uh, wire it looks like a spaghetti wiring mess but you know how it is when you want to get it hooked up as fast as you can you just kind of start throwing it all together and then uh, piece by piece you take it all apart you know like this I got that breaker installed I did it nice and neat I still have to put some you know some zip ties on things and tidy it up oh well, that was some of the other stuff I was, was charging charging that too let's see where we're at here 12.6 all right take it easy thanks for watching